On this day in history, on August 21st, 2017, Bontair, Missouri experienced a total solar eclipse. It had been 150 years since the last eclipse in the state, which made this a special occasion. According to the Daily Journal, the St. Louis Eclipse Task Force provided St. Francis, Madison, and Iron County schools with total solar eclipse glasses. Wearing eclipse glasses is essential as it can lead to blurred vision and a central scotoma, which is a blind spot in the center of someone's eye. A person must realize what is happening when viewing a total solar eclipse. During an eclipse, the moon passes between the sun and the earth, creating a shadow that is casted on earth. This results in the moon blocking the sun. Depending on the location, the moon can partially or entirely block the sun, like in Bonterre. The people in Bonterre waited eagerly as the path of totality slowly came. Residents could view the total solar eclipse around 1.17 p.m. for about 2 minutes and 17 seconds. When it finally arrived, people were excited. So dope. I can see it on video. Totality, folks. This is just too much. Ooh, man. Oh, my gosh. That is amazing. That we got a little. Anyone who wants to experience another total solar eclipse can watch it around 2 p.m. on April 8, 2024. Park Hills and Farmington will experience totality as well for about one to two minutes. The Missouri Mines State Historic Site and St. Joe State Park in Park Hills, Missouri are some locations to watch the upcoming eclipse. Residents can also watch the upcoming eclipse at the Bon Terre Space Museum. People will not be able to see another total solar eclipse in America until 2044. So get solar eclipse glasses and enjoy the upcoming eclipse on April 8th, 2024.